It is said you can't escape from a sinking car. The old advice says, wait until the cabin's full, but that sounds like a terrible plan. To test it, Adam picked a second-hand muscle car worth over $100,000. The first step was to remove the engine and all its components, replaced with equal weight, so the sinking felt real but without leaking oil. Test site was set in a giant swimming pool. Adam wore a wetsuit, oxygen tank, and put a backup tank in the passenger seat, then got into the driver's seat and was lowered into the pool by a crane. The car eased into the water. Cold waves sloshed in through the gaps. Halfway down, the pressure hit like a wall. Inside, it felt like forever. Outside, perfectly calm. Adam was holding his breath, trying to force the door open with his body, but it wouldn't budge. The water crept up, swallowing the last pockets of air. His breath ran out, and he had to use the oxygen tank. Only once the cabin was completely flooded was he able to open the door and swim to the surface. Freedom at last. But the clock read three minutes. In real life, most people wouldn't last that long. So here's the truth. Waiting is deadly. Your best shot? Act fast before the water's too high. Would you remember that in the panic of the moment?